wrong, Max. I had a packet of cheesels somewhere here I was saving as a special snack, but it's gone! Oh. Uh. Whoops. Whoops? What do you mean, whoops? Well, um, I may have eaten those. I didn't know they were yours. I thought they were left over from youth group. You ate them? Yes. Sorry. Sorry? You ate my special cheesels and all you can say is sorry. <coughs> Maximilian Mouse, stop it. That is disgraceful. You are not setting a good example for the kids. I said I was sorry, and there's no excuse for hitting. But my cheesels gone. I'll never forgive you. Seriously? Seriously? Max, I think you've forgotten something. No, I haven't. Weren't you listening to the Bible reading just then? To what Jesus said about making sure you forgive others from your heart? I don't feel like it. I didn't feel like forgiving you last week either, when you accidentally let, let the handbrake off in my car while you were searching for the lost change in the console. It was only a little, well, maybe medium-sized dent, and the neighbour did say that fence was old and rotten anyway. <laughs> Max, I forgave you for that. And you won't forgive me for eating your snack? All right. I'll think about forgiving you. I know God wants me to do it. I know he's forgiven me for lots of things and expects me to do the same. But I don't feel like it. I want my cheesels. <laughs> Max, I'm really sorry I ate your snack. Okay, Lionel, let's say I forgive you in theory. I just need a little more time to feel like I've forgiven you. Forgiving me in theory is a good start. You better ask God to help you feel less angry. In the meantime, why don't you say the memory verse? I can't. Why? I'll feel silly. The kids will have to look it up. It's Luke chapter 6, verse 37. Luke chapter 6, verse 37. Okay, kids, go look it up. Luke chapter 6, verse 37. Max, maybe you could tell a joke to take your mind off being upset. I don't think I could tell a joke right now, Lionel. Maybe you should do it. The kids will be expecting one. Me. All right, but this is a once only offer, just to show how genu genuinely sorry I am that I upset you. Are you ready? Ready, go for it, Lionel. Well, you know, I lost my hair years ago, but I still carry my comb. Really? Yes, I just can't seem to part with it.